This year, the R35 GTR celebrates its 11th birthday. There's a saying that you can't teach old dogs new tricks, but over the last decade, Nissan has continually developed its super sports car, relentlessly chasing incremental gains, culminating in this, the 2018 GTR Nismo. It's a very different beast to the car that made its debut at the 2007 Tokyo Motor Show. Its 3.8 litre twin turbo V6 now produces 441 kilowatts and 652 newton metres, an increase of 84 kilowatts over that original R35. The Nismo's body shell is stiffer than a standard GTR's. Its suspension and tyres are optimised for racetrack use, while lighter wheels, a titanium exhaust and the use of carbon fibre sheds 23 kilograms. To really understand the nature of these changes, you need a racetrack, such as this one, the Ben Motorsport Park. The speed, obviously, is insane. The GDR is no lightweight, but its acceleration is relentless. It doesn't sound amazing, but its industrial roar has a charm all of its own. The brakes aren't fancy carbons, but they work tirelessly, hauling the GTR down, even from the 250 plus we're seeing here at the end of the main straight. It's been a bit damp this morning, but even then the purchase and traction that these Dunlop semi-slicks find is very impressive. You have to be a bit careful, as when the car does slide, it does so quite quickly. But it provides plenty of feedback, especially from the front end. In the dry, the Nismo is just brutal. It's one of the few road cars that is constrained only by how hard you can drive. You don't have to worry about managing traction or brakes or tyres. The harder you push, the faster you will go. You can question the value of a $300,000 GTR, especially when the standard car is so fast. But out here, it makes total sense. This old dog still knows a few tricks. <laughs>